What is going on guys? Now damn, 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 damn. Tell me you've seen the latest Destiny 2 gameplay trailer. How can you not be hyped for this game? It is absolutely amazing. So in this video, we're gonna go through things I spotted straight away and then maybe bring you another detailed video uh, later when I look back at it and see if I find anything else interesting. But before we go any further, guys, I'm giving away a Rockstar Destiny 2 exclusive in-game gear code. To win, simply drop a like on this video and leave a comment. Okay, so check out the trailer right here, right now, if you haven't seen it. The city is secure. Those who fled are being hunted, and those foolish enough to remain have been executed. Do you see all that I have done? The war is over, and we've lost. Our numbers will continue to dwindle. We can no longer protect ourselves, much less the survivors. We all know what needs to be done. Get up close and personal with go. Put a bullet in his head. Then maybe eat a sandwich. <laughs> An outright assault is doomed to fate. There will be no coming back. It's worth it. If the Red Legion want war, give them war. Humanity never deserved power. I am God, and I alone am worthy. That was epic. The more I watch it, the better it gets. Okay, so the trailer starts with Gary being addressed by his console, no doubt. But what we see next is something I called on a video about a week ago. I called the speaker had been taken by Gary. I knew it. Check it out. Now coming away from Edge for a second, even though they've kidnapped one of your most valued allies. Who are we talking about here? Now the one person who we would call a most valued ally, besides Cade, Savala, Ikora and a few of the other vendors, I'd probably say the speaker is the one person where there's a mystery surrounding him within Destiny 2. Is this the valued ally they speak about? Are they going to use that against us? And I guarantee you guys, Gary will use the speaker against us in some way or another. Okay, so next up we saw Guardians preparing to take on the fight. Notice the hunter and that sword on his back. Damn, that thing's big. Also the Titans are awesome looking future Warcourt hand cannon. When it pans to the front view of these Guardians we see the Hunter seems to be holding what looks to be the 8 shooter people speculated was an exotic. Nice to see it again. We then see cinematic footage which is great. Now it's important to mention that these are cinematics. What the Guardians here are wearing might not be available in game but damn some of their gear does look awesome. Now before we saw Hawthorne we see Guardians sneaking through a corridor. But look at that warlock, look at that helmet. Now it's hard to spot at first, but Jesus, it looks awesome. We do see a better shot at it, which is here right now. And no doubt about it, this is Vex armor. That is a Vex helmet, there's no doubt about it. No point in the discussion. That is incredible, and I hope it's in game for us to obtain. We then get another cinematic, which shows I call a ride and a sparrow. Something I don't think we've seen before. Great, great, great. Something else to mention here is we also see a horse behind Ikora within these cinematics. Imagine being able to man a horse within the game. Just imagine. 
Next up we see a hunter holding something what seems to be something new, something we ain't seen before. Check it out. Surely that's a fusion, but then look at that sculpt. Could it be a linear fusion? Its design looks amazing too. Exotic? Possibly. Next up we get a quick look at a new character I believe, someone who will be an important foe no doubt. He looks like a beast for sure. Then we get a glimpse at what looks to be the biggest boss ever in Destiny. Look at the size of this fella. This could possibly be a raid boss, uh, but we only see two guardians fighting him. Maybe it's a strike boss, but who knows. Damn though, he is enormous. And on that note guys, I'm going to end the video, but how epic was that trailer? Truly awesome. Now I'm going to study this video to see if I've missed anything. If you guys have spotted something I didn't mention, let me know down below in that comment section. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks as always for stopping by and I will see you on that next one. Always in the wrong, knowing where we stand, but you and I will carry on, we never get it right.